This is a 14 inch snare drum branded as Union. It's one of those entry level drum kits you get for two to three hundred dollars. I'm not sure if they come from Japan or China. It was originally a blue wrap and the young client stripped all the hardware, removed the wrap and added this custom drum notation wrap which is actually pretty nice. However, upon putting it back, the bottom head didn't quite fit. It was probably egged or bent. So he tried to rectify the situation with some vice grips, which went gnarly awry. I've seen a couple other issues with this. So the first thing to do is we're gonna strip it all down and get a lay of the land. I got it all stripped down. It had this press fit snare vent, which is crap. Throwback to vice grips. Snares are cheap, but they'll work. Held on by this plastic crap. I'm gonna use ribbon, so that's junk. The lugs are pot metal, which is expected. And the hoop that had the vice grips is all cracked, bent, warbled, trashed, so that's no good. In terms of the shell, I thought it was gonna be poplar, but it looks like it's some kind of uh, basswood. It's really light. Four to five plies, glue sludge and spillage that they didn't wipe up. A lot of delamination. And the bearing edge is actually a half-ass roundover with a lot of flat spots. So I think the first course of action will be to squirt glue down in all these delamination voids, clamp that up, let that dry. Once that's done, we'll give the shell a quick sanding hide all these atrocities. Gonna recut the edges as best I can. There's a lot of flex in the shell because it's so thin, so it'll rock, but if you press it down to the table, it'll flatten out, so that's gonna be interesting. A Little bit of hand sanding of the edges after that, and then I think I'm gonna seal the inside and outside with shellac to try to dress it up, and since I already have it apart, I might as well. Got new hoop stock courtesy of the Calderwood Percussion Graveyard. I was pretty conservative with the sanding because the original builders already blasted through the veneer in several spots, especially here. Nasty. On to edging. The snare beds on this are horrible, but I can only put so much lipstick on a pig. I'm kind of leaving you hanging on this one. Since I tore off the wrap in the heat of passion, I can't reassemble. And since I can't reassemble, I really can't take it for a test drive. What I have done is supplied two lengths of this ribbon to reattach the snares, and a bit of lithium grease for the tension rods. That just leaves the replacement hoops from the Calderwood graveyard. Then I'm gonna deliver this to the owner, he'll rewrap it, he'll reassemble. This time without vice grips.